Hello, good afternoon, good morning, or good evening, um, everybody. This is Donna Brown. I just wanted to um, say hello to everybody and touch base. I know um, there's talks of recessions out there and we're looking at the stock market and our investment portfolios. They don't look as great. Um, I can tell you that it, it sucks looking at them right now, but um, let's get some perspective and some information um, where we are heading. So I wanted to share a little bit with you and I wanted to share my um, input just to kind of um, remind us of uh, where we're at with our investments. So let me see if I can share my screen here. All right, so here we are. So um, I wanted to share with you this um, information that I have, the anatomy of recession, what to look for, and where we're headed as of quarter, second quarter of 2022. Really what I wanted to uh, focus on is that the opportunity that we have at this time to, to get in the market. It's more so much about uh, the time in the market as opposed to timing the market as we cannot always tell uh, the bottom drop or the height of the market, uh, but we can reduce the risk and increase our the odds in our favor um, by looking at our opportunities to invest. Um, a lot of the times um, we hear all this news about um, when we look at the market and what happens is, you know, when the market's down, all the novice traders are panicking and selling off. And so you, you see this bigger drop when, of course, there's inflation in the, in the picture and whatnot. Um, but um, I wanted to show you this picture. Um, currently, as per the um, indicators that we have, we are currently still in the expansion state. Um, so with that, we can see that credit spreads is mark X. Um, we can see that um, interest rates are going up. Um, so that's one right there and wage growth is down, but everything else is green. Um, we can look at the recession in 2008 and see what that looks like. It's all red and yellow and we're not there at that stage. We are still in the expansion stage. So it's still a, a great opportunity for us to get in the market. Um, one thing that I wanted to show briefly, this is a, a brief video uh, in here. Um, well, first of all, the, let me find it here. We are in this, um, an upward market, even though we have had those dips in times, but overall, over time, we know that we're going upward in the in the United States economy and in, in investing in the stocks and, and funds. Let me show you this part right here. A lot of the times we get um, we zoom in on the negative on the down, which is you know typical because we can get really emotional. It's our hard earned money. And we don't want to, to lose that. Um, but we can see here that, let's take an example in 2018. Um, we can see that it was down, and we know that it was down, um, but down lower than 20%. But if you look at, well, where is 2009, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14? That's sort of the years following this um, down in 2008 recession. So let's look over here where 2009 is, is actually here, it bounced back in over 20% return. Um, so to that's 2009 and where's 2010 is right here between 10 and 20%. And 2011, zero to 10%. In 2012, back to 10 to 20%. 2013, where's 2013? Uh, it's right here, back up to 20%. And up 2017, 2019, 2021 is up 20%. If you had had an opportunity to invest in 2008, um, that would have been a great opportunity when the market was down because you would have had several years of 
double digit return. And so that's kind of where we're at. Um, we can look at our portfolio and it's not looking that great, but we can see that it always bounced back historically. That's where we're headed. Um, it bounces back it, and it takes some time, but it will eventually bounce back. And we can see from that scenario that several years after we have double digit returns. So we can take a look at this opportunity um, to get in the market actually, because this is the time where uh, if we think about it, when we go to Walmart or any retail store, we buy things that are on sale uh, because they're, they're cheaper. Um, sometimes, a lot of times when we're novice investors um, and the emotions come into play, we kind of do the opposite in investing. We kind of sell off or uh, shy away from it when things are down because um, we're not so sure. Um, but it actually is a great opportunity to get in the market because the funds are on discounts. And we have a great opportunity to get in while it's low. You know, you've heard that expression, buy low and sell high. And that's where we want to be in. And that's where we're at right now. So hopefully this can be a little bit of an ease to you and a helpful um, looking at our portfolios. And it's good time to be investing and getting in the market. Um, obviously, it's going to help also with the dollar cost averaging, when you're contributing regularly on a monthly basis, you're gonna catch those down uh, uh, discounted prices um, every month as you know as it now builds up. Or um, so you're getting those discounts, your, your costs are averaged out so that you have a better uh, rate of return in the end. So hopefully this will help you a little bit uh, to kind of get a little bit more uh, perspective on how the market's doing right now. I wanted to end this uh, picture right here, just to remind everybody at this time, we are still in an expansion stage and hope to keep you posted and let you know how the market's doing as we move along in this year. So have a great summer and we'll talk to you soon. I hope you uh, enjoy the summer with your family and take the time to um, build relationship and um, enjoy to that 2022.